the best of the best east coast springs i know it's better than the rest east coast springs the rap in no one contest east coast springs hello guys what's up i'll go by the name east coast springs and if you are new to my channel welcome so apparently today i'm not doing a reaction but i'm talking about something that just came up online um i'm supposed to be reacting to live reports by aq and mi joint ep but i'll do that after i drop this video so apparently mi has been on the news and mi is what is trending mi saga is what is trending on nigerian twitter at the moment and this is because mi did something quite shitty and to, in my own um in my own opinion quite childish for him to say for someone that experienced and for someone that has been in the limelight for a long time you should know what can cross controversies and the kind of things he could say online and not filter his words better but um before i talk about my take on it totally i want you guys to see this so apparently mi was on black Bones live last night and we were just talking and just saying you know now the whole corona season everybody is on live so Emma and Black Bones were, were talking on online and Black and he said something about bit by size. So um, we're going to watch it together. So I'll not narrate the whole story and bore you out. So let's watch and see what Emma said about bit by size. Tiny little guy. I took him out one day. We went to rehab. The club used to be called rehab on uh, the Zenith Bank Road. And like, I, I was like, I mean, we were like, buying bottles he was just so happy man there were girls around him for the first time yeah you know i mean i was like dog like be calm now your size like your size on the beat you made all these hits and stuff he was like man he was shaking and then like right before we left i was like size let's go he was like sitting down i was like what's what the fuck is up you know what i mean apparently like he had ejaculated while sitting there <laughs> <laughs> at the thing sir um so that's it that what mi said about sars while talking on at black bones life well, in my opinion, there are some jokes and there are some extremes. MI should have known the limit of where the joke ends and where it can say stuff that can cause and blow out online. Like this one did. You can say I watched it from Insta Blog Ninja. Of course, this all they posted because this is the key part of the whole story. So um Emma has tried to back up his claims. He came online to apologize to beat by SARS and um Blackbones to try to back up his boss. MI's um, statement too by coming online to apologize um, to talk on why MI said what he said. So let's, I'll take you, let's watch it on Twitter and let's see what MI said and what um, Blackbone said. So apparently, look at what MI said here. MI said, I 100% apologize to Beat by Size. I was completely joking and it was on the live while I was sharing the funny story that him and I joked about for years. Sars came on immediately after I did and cleared up the story and told IG Live I was joking. Hmm. Then um, apparently Blackbones also tried to back up MI and said the same thing. So I'll just take you to Blackbones' um, tweets and let's see what Blackbones said. So um, this is what Blackbone said. About my IG life, MI was clearly joking because he saw SARS on the live video too. SARS came online, laughed about it, and then explained that it's a joke MI has always told for the longest. Everyone that watched knew M that MI was joking. Instablog just posted one side. So um, it may look as if um, SARS was cool with what they said and everything. But, um, but SARS tweets kind of like says otherwise. Let's go to Sars tweet and see what Sars uh, tweeted about the whole story and the whole controversy. So just check it out. Um, Sars, I kept it cool and told you last week to recount your statement because it might get out of hand, but you did nothing. Since you want to act like social distancing is playing you do with your mental health, you hear from me. That was his first tweet. Then check out this tweet. Am I a bad guy? You are very, very stupid for stooping so low to chat shit on Blackbone's IG Live. Since you think it's cool to cook up stories and dance my character online, then all my respect for you is out of the window. It's out the window. So um, that was Sars said. And um, since they may look as if Sars understood that it was a joke, apparently Sars is not cool with the whole story. It's not cool with whatever happened there, with whatever MI said. It's not cool. I don't think any guy would be cool with 
story is being cooked up about him on IG Live. It's really someone that has a reputation to keep, like bit by SARS. So even though MI has apologized publicly and uh, Black Boss has backed him up, it was a joke and all, it doesn't still take the fact that MI, a whole chairman, one of the best rappers in Africa and the reputation he has, and for someone with so much knowledge and wisdom, it doesn't change the fact that he made a mistake. And he made a mistake. And this one was quite childish and quite irrational for him because he just came online and he actually had to say something that delicate about another celebrity, which is not cool. A lot of people might see it as a joke, but a lot of people don't see it as a joke. A lot of people, some people will believe that story. And some people actually, no matter how they try to say it's a rumor, it's a joke and stuff, a lot of people will still believe that story. And a lot of people will see Sars as the guy that ejaculated while he was in the club because of some checks. So that's irrational for Emma. And that was a big blow to Emma. Come on, Emma, you should have done that. It was a sad stuff. And me being an MI fanatic, number one MI fanatic, to be honest, I'm disappointed. I'm disappointed. I still like his music. I like everything about MI. But this was a mistake that he made. This just shows how human he is. It's not like an, a superhuman or something. He's just as human as you can and he can make mistakes. Yeah, he has apologized, but yeah, we still have to tell him he effed up. Yeah. We have to tell him he effed up here. So that's it. Tell me your opinion about the whole story and the whole thing. What you think about everything that happened with um, MI, Black Bones, Big by Size, IG Live. Do you think MI deserves to be to be lamb, uh, to be lambasted as it was giving a whole lot of blows online? Or do you think we should just have mercy on him and just supposed to be like understood more anyway that's my opinion on it and if you're new to my channel please don't forget to hit that subscribe button don't forget to hit that like button and i'll see my next reaction please don't forget to drop your comments on the comment section below peace